Welcome back to the Lost Artistry Lash channel. My name is Caitlin and today I have the pleasure of walking you through this stunning volume set that I've created. I worked with B Curl, C Curl, and L Curl, which are not commonly mixed together. So I love when I have the right client who allows me to play around with different unique styles and gives me the opportunity to really let my creative side of lashing shine. So here's Anna's eye and as you can see, the outer corner does swoop down quite drastically just on the outer corner, but she has this beautiful lift along the inner corner. So to me, that speaks, okay, we've already got lift on that inner to middle of the eye. Let's go with B curl. Because Anna did specify that she wants a very beautiful cat eye effect, but it's really hard to get cat eye when we have a downturned eye like she has. So. I saw, okay, B curl, inner corners, that will be lovely. And then she does need quite a lot of lift along that outer corner, so I decided to work with L curl. L curl does offer a lot of lift, but she still wanted a softness to the set as well. So she had a very specific vision. So in order to keep the lash set looking really soft, I worked with L curl on only the top layer. That gave a lot of lift, that gave me the ability to really let that cat eye swoop pull through. And then on the bottom layer, I created a completely unique map. So on the bottom layer, I worked with C-curl. C-curl offered just enough lift that it kept my L-curl sitting higher. So it didn't droop the eye down, it really lifted everything up while creating that really nice darkness, almost like an eyeliner effect along the base. Now, she also wanted texture. So because she wanted texture, I thought, okay, well, well let's do 50% closed fans, AKA wet lashes, which are really trending right now. And I'll also do 50% in volume lashes. So we did mix handmade volume fans in wet lashes and open form from lengths five all the way to 14. And we also mixed Lost Artistry Lashes Ultra Dark Pre-Made line along that middle layer in a 3D fan in only eight millimeters. So that gave us additional darkness, but didn't really add a lot of changes to the overall look of the set. I really wanted that top layer to stand up and the rest just to look dark and full. But Anna's lashes, although they look quite thick, they are finer, so I didn't want to do anything too crazy. And then on the bottom layer, where I have my C curl, along that outer corner where, where the eye cuts in half, you can see from the pupil where that line cuts down and separates the B curl from the L curl. From that point forward, I worked with nine millimeters, 10 millimeters and eight millimeters, all feathered through, but only on the middle and bottom layer. And I did work with 3D and a few 7Ds in C curl for those as well. Again, lengths did not go over 10 millimeters, which looked even shorter because that bottom layer does sit lower than the top layer. So it really allowed my shaping to sit high and become much more defined. As always, I start my lash set with a cleanse and I finish with a super bonder. So by all means, if you have any questions about the set, feel free to go ahead and comment them below. I'm totally happy to answer them because I know how unique this set is and there's probably lots of questions about it. Otherwise, feel free to recreate this on your client. I would love for you to send me photos, save this map, take a screenshot, whatever you have to do and recreate it. And then please send us photos on Instagram at Lost Artistry Lash so we can see the work that you create with our Lost Artistry Lash products. Thank you so much for tuning in today. If you enjoyed this video, you will absolutely love this really detailed hybrid tutorial. I've gone ahead and linked it for you. Click on it watch it it's so so detailed and it also helps if you're curious about how i mixed my wet lashes with my volume lashes because i definitely follow the same application pattern as shown in this hybrid tutorial so don't forget to check it out otherwise go ahead like comment and subscribe you would not believe how helpful it is for us in our business how motivating it is and that way you'll always get notified when we post brand new videos thanks again for watching brand new content like this. You would not believe how helpful and motivating it is for us to see your comments and that way then you can, no f f <laughs> Is that fine? Yeah, that's really good. Oh, I know how to spin it. It's so, so detailed and it also helps 